A student orchestra and choir performing the Marine Corps hymn and other military ballads in the Grapevine High School Auditorium was an emotional moment all its own. For veterans like Dan Decker sitting near the front row, the walk to get here had already been the highlight of an otherwise dark and dreary day. Moments earlier in what has become a more than two decade tradition at Grapevine High, a paper red carpet was placed in the high school halls and the invited veterans led by students on a ceremonial march got a long overdue parade, rousing applause, and a fist bump or two of their own. Yes, sir, thank you. Dan Decker, a Vietnam veteran, never had a welcome home like this. This is something else. This is uh, amazing. I My first time here. The Veterans Day ceremony included Navy veteran Stephen Holly, who started Dallas's Carry the Load, hoping a younger generation would understand all of this. They used to ride on guard. And as veterans and students chatted at a post-ceremony breakfast, it was clear that's exactly what is happening here. This is amazing. I'm blown away that the, the high school goes to this level, you know, and does this for us. I hope that they feel recognized and that they feel seen, that they feel heard. It reaffirms my belief in the future of America. And that's what some youthful exuberance, some red carpet and a long overdue thank you achieved on this Veterans Day. Thank you. With students and teachers promising to keep parading the same gesture of thanks every Veterans Day to come. Wow. Grapevine High School, I'm Kevin Reese.